It is time for the street one-shot challenge. We have the McLaren 12C for this, and so we need to make it understeer pretty drastically. It tends to be an incredibly unstable car. To do that, we put it a little lower to the ground, uh, leave the front suspension either a little bit stiff or right in the middle, and then completely soften up the rear suspension. If I had minus 50 or for gears, I would definitely do that. But as it stands, I'm going to leave it right in the middle. And away we go. Now this is a fairly large course. So the AI shouldn't be too much of a problem. Now as this car has seven gears, even at right in the middle of the ratio options, you're still shifting a lot of the time in this car. And a lot of times you are shifting at times where you don't necessarily want to be shifting. A little tricky. And it's a very unstable car. It's a relatively stable setup, but even so, it's still quite the handful around most of these corners. Pretty much never wants to understeer. Now these cars do go fast enough that you do have to break for that first corner. I'm surprisingly behind my own time by a little bit. Felt like I was going a little bit faster this lap. That's a really unfortunate spot to catch an AI in. I basically lost the entire advantage I had, which was almost half a second. And then some on top of that. And because of the way I was approaching that car, there was no other way around that, really. Yeah, not only did I lose my half second, I lost a second on top of that let alone almost cost me two full seconds. And it's going to cost me a better entry here because I'm trying to make it all up in one turn. Alright, I got one more lap to try and do this. Not the fastest through there. have to catch an AI, that's not a terrible spot to catch it, so I can't just dive inside it like I did. I have to hope I do not catch the next car, or that if I do it's on a straightaway, that's the best place to catch them. Because you can line it up and figure out where they're going to go well ahead of time. Because they don't quite take the racing line. Unless you're right behind them and then they 
clog it like their Drano. Or, well, that wasn't the right phrase, but if you invert it, to not be Drano, but to be the clog, then it starts to make a little bit of sense. <laughs> Basically, they clogged the racing line. <laughs> That's the point I was trying to make. <laughs> uh, just one more turn. Be a little conservative on it since I'm already way up on my time. Just push it hard to the finish line. It's not going to be the best time because it was still pretty loose. But for our one shot at Chicago, not too bad. Actually, that's not too bad at all. That's faster than I... I figured Platinum would be around a 39 or a 40. So, a better time than I thought it would be. Good, good.